this video I'm going to show you how to make your own QR code. For those of you who don't know what a QR code is, um, there are some examples now up on your screen. They're used in a variety of uh, situations. Uh, they started off in the car industry, um, but then they've been widely adopted by lots of different kind of companies and for lots of different reasons. Essentially, if you have a QR code reader on your mobile phone, you can scan in the QR code and it can open up a web page or show you some text file, that sort of thing. Um, and they are incredibly easy to make. So to make one, I'm going to use this website here called qrstuff.com. There are lots of different websites out there. Most of them are free. You don't need to spend any money on this. Um, all you need to do is decide on what is the content you want it to display. What I've decided to do is link it to a specific point in uh, the movie of Mice and Men and it's the point where um, I think it's George or is it Lenny? I can't remember. He um, he, he kills um, uh, the wife and I can't remember who <laughs> what the wife's called either but it doesn't really matter. But I'm going to link it to uh, this point in the video. So I'm going to go to share and I'm going to get it to start at this point and I'm going to copy this um, bit of code here so I'm going to highlight that copy it and I'm going to take it to the QR code generator I'm going to go either it doesn't really matter you can go to the website URL and you can paste that in there um, you can link it directly to a YouTube video if you want and as soon as I paste that code in you'll notice that the QR code uh, preview has changed if I um, Let's forward it up to another point here. Let's make it round it up to 20. Let's take that code that's generated there and paste it in. As soon as I paste this in, you'll notice that the code, the QR code changes. Um, there it is, it's changed and it's now offering me a chance to save it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the code. Uh, I'm going to save it to my desktop and I'm going to um, go... Um, of mice and men QR code and click save and now if I open up my code my code opens up and there is my QR code and ready to put into my worksheet that's it that's all I've got to do